What's up guys, Main Man Sui here, hoping you're all doing awesome as always. And I stumbled upon this video here from Vortex Tournament 2019. I have no idea when this was played, I'm guessing it was at least a few months ago. It was prior to EVA Japan, right? Pakistani players, help me out here. I tried googling it, but I can't find any information on it. Pretty much, but we have Arslan Ash fighting a vice honey and oh my god look at the swag with the jacket there and that face that just oh my god he seems like a nice guy but uh, i've heard a lot about a vice honey that yeah he's supposed to have a super deadly akuma and when i think akuma i think a lot about uh Riksta from the us and then super akuma who is a local talent in the eu i know there are korean and amazing korean akuma players of course but uh, holy shit, check out this match with him here. And here we have Arslan Ash, who of course everyone by this point knows who he is. After EVO Japan, where he crushed everyone. But that's why, you know, everyone's wondering like, okay, how strong is the Pakistani Tekken scene? It's probably pretty strong considering Arslan's level of play. And, you know, of course that doesn't come 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 about you you know in a complete vacuum he pr he has obviously trained with very strong opponents and here's playing geese a character i love and wow these guys they know the 2d characters quite well <laughs> it turns out so um yeah be on the, the lookout here uh, check out avai honey's uh, akuma which is a total beast and arslan ash of course not playing Kazumi, which we what which is what we usually see and what we associate with him. And his his geese is just insane. I've seen him play geese in other matches and uh, holy hell the setups he does. Um so th th these are about to be really intense matches here. I think we're playing a best of three. But it is worth noting that uh, at the local Pakistani tournaments, Arslan Ash is not a given, you know, to win the tournament. You know, he struggles quite a bit. Uh, Pakistan, turns out, is no joke at all. Like, I think they have many deadly players. And uh, yeah, who knows what happens at Tekken World Tour, you know, when the prize pool has been increased to $185,000, whereas uh, a good chunk of that, the majority actually, 100000 is reserved for the finals. Here we go with the Akuma, well, pretty much death combo if there's a wall nearby. And if he is in rage, that is gonna kill. Uh, so it's 1-1 one, one in round, uh, Avice has a slight life lead here, but yes, we do not count out Arslan Ash just yet. And this is of course Geese Howard, who has insane combo capabilities, but that's going to be it while running one on the wall. Uh, so Avice here, up uh, two rounds. Two rounds to one. So can Ash get anything going this round? He surely needs it. The Puken! Oh, a nice punish there, with punish on the Buhado or whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, so we got some pressure here, but both, both are being very careful. No counter it round 4 4 4, that would have meant a launch. Oh fuck, 2 4 1, this is gonna hurt a lot. Re splat with the jumping Rapukin! And yeah, signature wall pressure here from Geese. Uh, his use of a jumping Rapukin? Why, why am I not doing that? I mean, I even know it's like super plus on, on walk. Nice. Uh, dick jab to forward one. Uh, Geese counter hit dick jab actually combos into his forward one into special. A lot of people don't know that. It's, it's super good. Super good. Ah, what? Oh shit. Yeah, sick pressure there at the wall. That's gonna get punished. Perfect punish. I'll send you one into four circle back one. That's a big whip, did not get punished. Oh, the entire string. Oh, no, that's not again. Uh, wow. Oh, shit. Oh, oh no. He's at the wall. He's not looking good. Oh, no. Big comeback. And there's the dick job. 
But uh, did you guys see the use of a jumping Rapuken? I think it's called Shinpuken. Oh no, Shippuken. Shippuken. Holy shit. So he jumped, did the Shippuken, and a vice sidestepped, I think. It hit, and then he had time to run up and standing four to wall spot, and that comboed. That's such a sick setup. I, I don't think I've seen anyone use that before. Uh, but yeah, fair to say I haven't seen uh, a majority of uh, professional geese players, but that was sick. Geese pressure. Oh shit, focus attack. Oh, he's gonna hit the wall. Oh, the wall travel. What's for breakfast? Oh, he waited out the parry. Very smart by Abyss. Uh, so just a very tiny life lead here, uh, that's about to get bigger. No wall splat. Movement, movement, no counters on down four. Great duck there, breaks the throw. They're very even here in the second match. Arslan up one match. Rage, oh! Isn't that possible to hit confirm? Yeah, maybe not. He played it safe. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, so he's gonna hit the wall again. That's wall travel combo. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, you're fucked. Unseeable low into death. What the hell just happened? Was he gonna style or something? Oh shit, the combo. Pressure, pressure. Oh, Shippuken. Okay. So he goes on the offense, uh, Abyss just blocks, and then suddenly he backs off. Uh, I don't know why, I would have just pitballed there. But I mean, yeah. Ash probably knows a little bit more than I do. Um, but uh, at the end there he went for the big low, and that was blocked. Uh, it's very risky, I think it's 25 frames, so... It's exactly like um, Noctis, but I think Geese low has a as an easier animation to read for the opponent uh, nice punish there both playing very carefully oh that could have been big and this is going to be big damn the wow no round brown uh, yeah, Avice is uh, pretty good with Akuma, and the combos he's doing, I mean, uh, he's so consistent, and these are very difficult combos, like, uh, those of you who don't know, Akuma, uh, he's annoying and he has gimmicks, but it can be very annoying if you don't know how to handle him, how to defend against him, you know, with his jumps and demon flip. But uh, at the same time, you have to give a lot of credit to people who play Akuma at a high level because the execution is almost like nothing else. Uh, Akuma, Kazuya, and Lee. They are kind of, our geese is almost up there, but a tiny bit easier on the execution. Uh, but amazing game so far, 1-1. One, one. It's really cool to see these 2D guest characters being used at such a high level. This might be amusing. This might be amusing. Oh, that voice line. It always gives me a stick. Uh, he is such a male. Uh, That's gonna pawn. He is most likely gonna hit the wall. Perfect. What's for breakfast? Okay, again, like very careful. Ford, 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 Eitel's blocked. I'm gonna back away. That's gonna get punished. Nice interrupt with the dick jab there, and of course guarantees a full strength. Can Ash get a comeback here? And he's jabbed out of the air, and that's it. Uh, so no bars on Ash. Uh, one bar on Akuma, and up one round here. He's won four rounds in a row versus Ash. Nice. That's blocked. Nice punish. Oh, big counter hit. 
And it's that beautiful calm again for for you. Oh no, okay. Oh. He optimizes the combos perfectly to get the wall splash. Nice uh, low parry, that's gonna be it. Okay, I actually have to ba back a bit here. He re splats him with the Tatsu. He gets a, a double wall splat. His combo optimization is pretty scary, to be honest. And he's won five rounds in a row. Big counter it on 4 4 4. Okay, so he has a pretty decent lead here, and he's up two rounds on Ash. I dropped the combo, okay. But it's looking very grim for Ash here. Yeah, that sure you can didn't help. Oh, oh nice. Jabbed out of the air again. That's a pretty good Akuma, don't you think? Uh, and that was the set. And uh, from what I've read, Arsenal Ash didn't win that tournament. Uh, I don't think he even reached grand finals. So yeah, just trying to get uh, more of Pakistan out on the map. Uh, well, the Tekken community map. Uh, they have a, a shit ton of great players. And uh, Avais Hani deserves to be shown, you know. He... he, he sh I mean... I think if more people knew about him, especially Akuma players, you know, I think a lot, a lot of new uh, Akuma Meida perhaps would get out there, and he could serve as an inspiration, you know, to you if you want to play Akuma. Uh, just beautiful to watch, and Arslan Ash has a great geese. Um, so yeah, there are really, really, really strong players in Pakistan. We'll probably not only see Arslan Ash in coming tournaments. Uh, so hope you enjoyed that set and have a nice day.